the video. As you guys can see, this is a completely, completely different layout. See here, yeah, I got the Jeep. Took a couple of pictures and stuff like that. And as you can see, the hood is on there. We actually did that. But as you can see how massive this driveway is. This car, tree, all this is coming out. It's going to be redone. That wall got a little lean in it, so it's going to be straightened out. All this is going to be straightened out. Uh, we might put a little wall in here to actually support the concrete. But as you guys can see, this can fit over about six cars. So it could fit probably six side by side, I should say, including the truck. So as you guys can see, it is pretty decent. It's pretty wide. Backyard space. We're going to do a lot of work. All that stuff in nobody way. I got to come down. So much things going on, guys. There's so many things that's going on today. I got to get inside there. We're going to be doing some sanding today. We're not going to do anything with the Jeep, unfortunately. Um, as you see, the truck's not here. It's actually over there. We're going to just take it and, uh, you know, drop the kids off and run to Home Depot and buy everything. But as you guys can see, oh, this, this Jeep, this Jeep right here super sick with the new hood the new grill and this looks completely different it just looks badass doesn't it now imagine when the wheels get on here axles wheels get on here and then the new drive shafts oh it's gonna look so good i'm telling you guys um, as i said before we're trying to invest in some real estate and this is the property one of the properties that we bought well i'll say the property that we bought we're gonna be buying some more in the future Boy, came through. help me uh swap out all of these because they, they need it done. Let me show you what's up. This is how the previous one looked it, like something like this. Let me show you how to really work. Tomorrow, we sand down this floor. We're gonna be doing the floor over. We got the press equipment for it. I like the stuff that I had. I already started down here. We got the better equipment. The one that I got doesn't do a really good job. It's not powerful at all. But as you can see, the reason why we swap them, now look at this. this. This was a plug that was in the wall. You, know, you have that here. If that breaks off, kids touch it. As you can see, that was exactly where that was. Just, uh, swap these out, putting a bunch of them. Putting them all down here, all the outlets. This one here is it's, it's kind of more outdoor weather resistant, but got the new outlets in. New outlets in. Can't wait really to get that, that, that equipment stuff. Don't use that as old. We got blue lights in. Just clean up everything. We're doing some major painting and I gotta re-sand these whole floors, so yeah. Look at this. We're getting the floor done. Oh wee. My boy over there working his magic, getting the floor sand down for us. That looks so good. Yesterday I was using the other machine. We're like taking our time going over this. It needs tons of work over there. But we it did. took me like three times the amount of time that it took him to do that. Four times.
real emphasis on getting the floor cleaned up of all the dust because if you do not that will be in your finish and you do not want that even though you can do a buffing after the first coat but yeah we're getting this all this up so This is the first coat. It looks different on camera, but oh, it looks like a golden color. It's still light, which I want to contrast. Don't worry, we're gonna paint the faces. Um, I think a gray or white. When do faces take this off? Hit this with a white, but this not done yet. It needs to be rebuffed. Um, it has to be rebuffed and recoated with a second coat with that water. Uh, that uh, water base, I forgot, he, he know what it is, but I, I don't know what that much of a thing to call it, because I'm not a pro. But um, you see how that is, white trimming, little light light gray walls. So it's gonna be sexy when we're done. Um, this is transformed so much. <laughs> first two days I had a machine that wasn't that great and it took me longer to do the floor my boy came with his better equipment eight thousand dollars equipment um, more than like probably like I would say like 20 grand worth of, of, of professional equipment we, he came in and uh, now we got the U-Haul this morning because we are moving the we are going to move the tenants in downstairs we're gonna be moving them in and then uh, we will be finishing up the floors later on I told you guys there's a lot of stuff going on I gotta get prices for shops and stuff, and then I'm telling you, we'll get back to banging out the Jeep stuff. But I know you guys wanna see Jeep stuff, so a lot of work. See y'all in a little bit. This place is an absolute mess, but we have got the tenants downstairs, they all squared away, and we got the floors. The first coat finished. That looks so good. Like transformation. Like you don't believe. We, we did a first coat here. We're doing all the trimming white. I don't know if you guys can see all that, but we're doing all the trimming right in, in this uh, particular uh, unit here. Um, it's a lot, a lot more to go. I'm looking for a rag, but I don't know what I did with it. Um, it's fun to work. But as you can see, it's looking phenomenal. Like phenomenal. Let me turn it up in here, but look at this floor. Oh my god, I'm happy bro with this. Look at it. He even scraped this part and hit that too. Look at it. Oh, oh my god. And this is a stain, so that's not coming out. You have to replace that wood uh, if you want that to come out. But dude, that looks, oh man, it looks amazing. Ten times better than it did. And I showed you guys before. Matter of fact, let me show you a clip of it. Look how this place is coming out. Yeah, uh, so we're just finally getting to uh, like moving in and doing some things and getting this all set up. Uh, I think we're almost ready to call it a day. Um, wife bought the nice thing, so. Slowly but surely, slowly but surely. That's gonna end it for this week's video. I mean, it's been a little bit more than a week, but oh man, I'm exhausted, I'm telling you. I did so much work, I got a brace on. I don't know if you can see that, huh? show you see had to put this on carpet tunnel going on so 
Yeah, so I'm out of here. I can get back to work. So I'll see you guys real soon. Next video. We're jumping into the Jeep project. As you can see, it's way back there. But oh man, that thing's sexy. But yeah, see you guys. Next video. Take care. Peace.